What's up guys, we're gonna bro beat so I'm gonna be showing you guys some quick fixes to the new update 20.7 of FL Studio. If you guys haven't subbed already or turned post notes on, make sure you do so because it does help it a lot. Let's hop right into it. So the first one isn't necessarily a fix, but it's just I see a lot of people asking, how do you change the color? How do you do this and that? So I'm gonna be showing you how to do that. So basically, um, in any menu, anything in FL or any like track, you can right click and change the color of anything. Okay, so here's like the new color selector. So you can change the color to anything, right? And that goes for the mixer as well. Just click change color. This is very basic stuff. Everyone should know how to do this, but you can change the color of anything in FL Studio, right? And then, you know, I'm just changing a few to show you and you could name it. All right. And then we go here, you can change it here. Okay. And then if you want to change the grid and the background, what you can do is click playlist options up here. Go to view grid color and you can change that to anything that you want. So you could change it to like a kind of red color, right? And same thing for the piano roll. So you right click, go to piano roll, and then you can change the color here. Now, if you want to change the note color, what you have to do is right click up here. Now, this is in the newest update. Um, so you right click, move this back over. And again, you can kind of you could change like the, the brightness, you can change the color. You just go for something like that. And let's change the background. So we're going to click up here, go to view, grid color, and you can just change that to whatever. OK, so now here's the issue. A lot of people, they're not sure how to access all of the colors. Right. So as you can see that all these are like grayed out. Right. And then these colors are grayed out. Right. And you can't really access them no matter what you do. So what you have to do is click this button. All right, it's, it's called lock to save colors. Now you want to turn this off so you can use, you can go as bright as you need to. You can use like the brightest colors if you want. Okay, and that gives you enough contrast so that you can see the notes. Okay, and then that works for anywhere on the playlist. Again, we can do it like right here, right? So if you want to go like, I don't want it to go a super bright color, we could do a dark one. And you can see it changes the color here. All right, so that is how you um, change the colors and unlock every single color that they uh, allow you to have. So now I'm gonna be showing you how to fix the ghost notes. All right, so now that you know how to color everything, now one issue, this is, I'm not sure if it's a bug, but I don't, I don't think it is a bug. I think it's intentional, but hopefully they fix it or just change it because I really don't like it. So say you're making hi-hats, so they can, this can be like our 808 pattern or something, right? And then you come in here and actually let's just duplicate this. Let's just make more notes. So it's like a more realistic. So we can just literally just copy a bunch of notes here. Okay. And let's make one more. Now, say you come here to do hi hats, right? Now the problem is that you can't see down here. You can see everything. It looks like it's the main, right? It's there's no difference. It looks like it's the main. Um, instrument that you're trying to edit, right? So there's no way for you to see like um, what notes that you have. So the only way to around this right now is to press Alt V, which turns off ghost notes. So if you just learn that shortcut, um, you can just easily turn them on and off when you want, okay? And you can continue to like do the hi hats and stuff, right? But you can see how annoying this would be. Um, I hope they fix this um, because I really don't like it. So, um. Again, Alt V, you can turn it off. And if you're not sure what shortcuts to use for whatever system you have, just click uh, piano roll options and then you can kind of look through everything and you can see. Um, and for here is helpers, go to ghost notes, Alt V, right? And then you can edit. Now, the other way around it is to change the color. So you want a, a color that contrasts uh, red. So you right click up here and then drag this over. Now we can do like a very dark green now, what you can do now, this is ugly. So I'm gonna change the grid. Well, actually, we could just leave it as is, but say you're making your hi hats. Now, one way around this is what I like to do is just highlight everything or you just press Alt uh, Control A and it'll highlight everything that you're work working on. So this is like a quick fix. So now you can kind of edit. OK. You can edit and everything. And if you want to, you know, edit the velocity. But again, hopefully they fix this. But yeah, that's going to be it. 
um that's just a quick fix all right very short video um make sure you guys like and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in the next one peace